Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Infinity Vision platform. Right now I will be doing one such question that came in your JE main examination. This question came on 26 August 2021 and this came on second shift. Okay, so this question, this question came on this year only. So let us see this question first. Question says, for a given circuit, the power across zener diode is. You have to find out the power across zener diode in milliwatt. milliwatt. Okay, this combination has been given to you. We already know the zener diode has a potential of 10 volt. So this combination, the load would also have a potential of 10 volt. Okay. If load has a potential of 10 volt, so you can easily calculate the load current over here. So it must be equal to, I must be equal to V by R. So V, what is V? Potential, I must be equal to V by, so this is a current across load, this load. I must be equal to V by R. So voltage is 10 volt and load is 5 kilo ohm. Load resistance is 5 kilo ohm. So you'll be getting as 2 milli amperes. This is the current that we are getting. Okay, so that means the current across this load is 2 milli ampere. Similarly, you can easily find out the current across this 1 kilo ohm resistor because the current, uh, because uh, potential across this Zener diode is 10 volts. So the potential across this voltage, this uh, resistor must be equal to 14 volt, which is 24 minus 10. So easily you can easily find out the current across this 1 kilo ohm resistor also, which is nothing but the current across this 1 kilo ohm resistor must be equal to V by R. What is V over here? 14. What is R? 1 kilo ohm. So finally you will be getting as 40 milliampere. So that means this is the current supplied by battery which will go like this and 2 ampere current will be divided over here. So this Zener current must be equal to 24, uh, 14 minus 2 milliampere which is 12 milliampere. Now we know the current across Zener diode and we also know the potential difference across it. Okay, so is you knowing these parameters, you can easily find out the power across this Zener diode. So the power must be equal to power must be equal to V into I. I Zener diode and potential over Zener diode, which is 10 multiplied by 12 milli ampere. Okay, and this is this is in volt, so you'll be getting as 12 120 milliwatt. So the power across Zener diode comes out to be 120 milliwatt. So the answer would be 120 over here. I hope this question is clear to everyone. Thank you.